What's going on, True Team? Hey, man, I came to talk to y'all about, hey, you know what's so crazy? I learned one thing through these months and these, these years, and I'm thinking one thing that makes sense. Focus on you and cut all the fuck shit out of your, your rear view mirror. Like, the thing is, bro, I'm really, I'm really, you know, you know, I talk about preaching about focusing on yourself and really staying focused on you and doing the things, but it's a lot of shit that can throw you off track and make you not want to focus on yourself because of all the shit that's going on around, right? But truth be told, my nigga, I'm going to tell y'all the real, man. I'm going to let y'all really know something. Focus on your motherfucking self and do what you got to do for you. Because truth be told, but don't nobody give a fuck about you, bro. Everybody, stop caring about what the next motherfucker got to say about you and your dreams and what you got going on. Because truth be told, bro, I've been going for so long, bro. I've been ups and downs, losing jobs, going through hoops, all types of shit. But now I'm finally steady, dealing with my kid problems, all types of shit, right? And now I'm finally steady as a man that can sit here and tell you, like, no matter what, I go through, nigga, it won't be able to knock me down, and it won't let me stay in that same fucking predicament ever again, bro. One thing I can sit here, bro, is really stay focused on the goals that really put you in a whole nother situation. As a man, your purpose matter more than other shit. It does. Your purpose is the reason why you going where you going. Your purpose is the reason what's taking you there. You have to be selfish in this life to, uh, before you can help anybody else. You can help motherfuckers, but you got to realize the people that you're giving the money to at the end of the day because it's taken from what you got going on. Fuck everybody else. Everybody wants you to take care of their wants and their needs and their accessories and the shit that they got going on, but ain't trying to do nothing for you or invest into your dream or care about what you got going on. They ain't nobody else's business, my nigga. You do what you got to do for you and you stay focused on the shit that you got to do for you, regardless of the motherfucking fact once you once you understand that staying focused on you mean being locked into your dreams and really locked into the point where you can't you can't scatter around the motherfucking place that's where shit starts to change at that's one thing i learned about this life bro is that i really sit here i sit here and stay within myself and understand what's going on people you got to realize you got two type of people in this world motherfuckers that complain and motherfuckers that go get something and actually change their life. You got those type of people in the world. Some The people that you want to be around is the people that's going to change their life. And that's where you focus on yourself and them the type of friends that you get around. You don't want to deal with a bunch of motherfuckers you know for a fact that it's not going nowhere. I've been gone for a minute, bro. I'm fucking back. I'm back. I'm back now. So I'm letting y'all know. Y'all going to see me every motherfucking day with videos dropping like fuck. I ain't playing no games with nobody, bro, because I learned, bro, all this time I didn't waste. I could have been somewhere else. I didn't wasted so much time dealing with fuck shit when I should have wasted the when I should have wasted the right time dealing with the right shit, taking care of the wrong motherfuckers, putting my energy into the wrong shit. And as I'm sitting back, bro, I've been smiling more. I ain't been angry about nothing. A lot of shit don't even bother me no more. I don't let shit bother me no more. I really don't be giving a fuck about it. Either a person wants to change around you or do better and if they don't you just move around my nigga don't make you less selfish don't make you a fucked up individual because you choose to move around some dumb shit a lot of people is just stuck in their mind you got to realize bro you, we in a world where some motherfuckers is going to grow up and some not going to grow up some going to be different and some not going to be different some going to understand morals and principles and some not everybody feel like you owe them something so you got to really focus on the, the net like the, the the certain situations with that shit she Motherfuckers be broke as fuck, don't want nothing. They everyday life is trying to look fat. That's, that's a lot of bitches' problem, too. They be trying to look good for every nigga that walk around and don't got a dollar to their name. Like, your nails is not that important. That fake-ass hair is not that important. Like, that, all that extra shit is not that important. Once you start realizing being your natural self as a female is the best thing to do, that's where you start really changing your life around. Yeah, you do what you do, but everybody claim to have self-love when they do shit that's not self-love like a nigga. When you feel like that you need all the clothes in the world, all the jewelry in the world, everything to pull a woman or be around. It's because you're attracting a certain kind of wrong people. This is why I say you have to love yourself at the end of the day. Fuck what everybody else saying and stop caring about what the next motherfucker got to say about what you're doing. Because reality in this lifetime, since we speaking on some shit, the same motherfuckers that speaking on you will be in the same situation 23 years from now. They're still, they they already, they're 40 plus. They've been there for the longest, my nigga. Like, they're going to be there. Them be the same motherfuckers that sit down and talk about everything you got going on. We live in a world where motherfuckers feel like they can just get rich by not doing nothing. That's the type of world we live in. They can just get rich by not doing nothing. Nothing don't count. That's the problem with niggas. But you have to have some type of skill. Everybody has a purpose. It's just, if you're going to find that motherfucker, you're going to stick to that motherfucking purpose and you're going to do what you're supposed to do. 
That's all I'm saying. At some point in life, you got to realize, like, is you going to stick to the purpose you got going on or you going to sit there and complain about it? Because people, people fell to realize, like, bro, you have a fucking purpose. It's either what purpose you choose to push and you choose to do. See, niggas don't understand that shit, bro. I'm back on my music. I'm back on a lot of shit, bro. I'm, I'm really, I've been, I've been behind the scenes doing shit. I ain't really been on social media. You get what I'm saying? But I'm back now. I was fucked up. I couldn't promote myself. I couldn't do the shit I was supposed to do. So I, I'm, I'm really moving in a different kind of light now. I really, I really know I, I can sit here and say everything that I got going on, bro. I'm more bigger than most motherfuckers. And the type of shit that come out of my mouth, everybody can't talk about or they can't do. You get what I'm saying? So I also got to remind myself of who I am and what I do. You get what I'm saying? Because I don't be around a bunch of motherfuckers who want better for themselves. I don't be around a bunch of motherfuckers who, who want to who wanna change their life. They rather complain about shit than make an actual growth experience in their life. See, people, one thing about life, you have to be able to accept change. If you can't accept change, you will never grow. If you fear things in life, you will never be able to grow. That's one thing about this life. You have to understand. Understand, you can't fear shit. Fear like like you you gotta really move with non fear. You gotta take a chance out this bitch. Fuck with everybody else talking about it how they feel. Take a fucking chance. That's how you win. That's how you grow. That's how you that's that's what you do. Peace. Follow me at actual truth underscore. Follow me at T dot two. Like, comment, subscribe to actual truth. Peace. Remember, love yourself and focus on yourself. Peace.